But yeah, about this car, <laughs> this is so funny. I'm not everybody. What's up guys welcome back to my channel if you guys are new my name is diamond and welcome so today i have another lspdfr episode for you guys really hope that you enjoy it right now i'm just grabbing some fruit because i have a feeling that i'm gonna get pretty hungry on this patrol today because i don't know i just feel like it's gonna be a long day guys so let's just see about it and uh, today i am using the north carolina highway patrol vehicles and guys, the last time I used it, um, yeah, I liked them. <laughs> so I figured that we would use the Slick Top today. So I am just feeling Slicky McSlickerson. So let's go ahead and do that. And if you have not subscribed to my channel yet, go ahead and do that. And also make sure to smash that like button and share my videos. And uh, yeah, just show love overall. So we're going to out like this and there we go because you guys know they never like to let you uh <laughs> like to let you cross traffic for some reason so yeah um and guys if you are new to my channel i am a girl gamer i don't know if you can tell from my voice and um yeah so i just play gta 5 lspdfr and um regular gta 5 as well and most of the time I um, upload every day and if I don't upload every day at least three times a week so this person is obviously a little afraid that I'm driving behind them or else they would not be driving so unbelievably slow guys do you guys think they have something to hide I don't know let's see uh, dispatch can I get a plate check please Let's see, guys. Do they have something to hide, or are they just scared? Target vehicle license plate two six Victor Adam license Robert expired. zero eight eight a traffic violation. Mm. Proceed with caution. No good. No good. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go ahead and stop this vehicle oh, right here. All right, let's get her to uh, pull over in a safe location, and um. Yeah, I'm going to pull her information up on the computer. Where is she going? Why are people stopping? Okay, come on. Pull it over, Chica. What are you doing? Oh my goodness, that's why her license is expired, guys. <laughs> that's why. Alright, let us um, just go into my vehicle. Okay, guys, here's also a look into the vehicle. And uh, I'm gonna bring up the computer and just see what we got to be completely honest. So Regina Carter, oh girl, it's expired for a year. Okay, um, I thought it said suspended. I don't know what I was thinking. Um, all right, and the vehicle, everything's good with the vehicle, but her license is expired. She should not be driving. All right, we're gonna get out and uh, just see what's going on. Oh, before that, let me tell dispatch I'm on a traffic stop. Dispatch, go ahead and show me 1011 vehicle occupied one time. 104 is backup required. All right, that's negative. 104, proceed with caution. All right, guys, let's walk up and see what's going on. You know what? Let me go on this side. <laughs> like, what the heck, lady? Hello, how are you doing today? All right, I could smell narcotics inside the vehicle. Can I have your documents, please? A license. Okay, so smell of narcotics. Thank you. All right, and uh, driver, let's see. Let's say some greeting, greeting questions. How are you doing today? I'm doing good so far. That's good. Do you know why I pulled you over? F my life. Okay, I mean, that's one way to look at it, I guess. Um, I'm smelling something coming from your vehicle. Have you taken any drugs recently? 
Yeah, I'm awesome. All right, guys, let's go ahead and call some backup to our location. Backup needed in Harmony. Because uh, she's just, I'm smelling it from her vehicle and I uh, want to make sure that I'm okay. So I'm just going to call some backup. All right, guys, let's, uh, let's get this lady out of her vehicle. <laughs> no wonder her license is expired. She's not even paying attention to what she's supposed to be doing. All right, ma'am, can you uh, step out of the vehicle for me, please? Come on and step out. Okay, let's talk to her, guys. Oh my gosh. Okay, guys, let's slow down the traffic because obviously people are acting crazy. Ma'am, ma'am, I just need you to uh, follow me over here. Thank you. Follow me right here. Okay, guys, we're going to have her. I want to be in like a good, nice space so that we can have her do all the uh, tests and stuff. So, all right. Oh, no. Am I somewhere where I could get attacked by a freaking mountain lion? Because I am not. That's not what we're trying to do today. We're not trying to get mauled. Okay, anyway, let's make her do a horizontal gaze test. All right, so just follow the tip of my pencil with your eyes, okay? All right, so, um, no. Okay, so she failed that, guys. And let's go ahead and do a walk and turn. All right, walk nine steps and then come back to me, okay? And have your uh, hands by your side. Okay, let's see. I need to hurry up because I think there's like a family of mountain lions over here. <laughs> so, yeah, I am not trying to get mauled because they're serious. Okay, so she failed that. Hands are shaking. All right, we're going to do one more test. Let's see if she can stand on one leg. All right, go ahead and do it. All right, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, she can't even she can't even do it for nine seconds, guys. So let's go ahead and detain her. The boys are gonna love you. What? That was why did he okay, no, I don't know. Interesting. Alright, let's see. So do you have anything on you that's gonna prick me, stab me, poke me, or cause me any harm today? Alright, let's see what she got. I'm feeling something in her shoes, guys, in her stockings. So okay. Baggies containing 2.5 kilograms and a total of white powder taped under the subject's arms. Okay. Okay. That's what we got. And um, let's also have my buddy drug swab her to see what drug she's on today before I uh, check out what she had on her. So, oh, the like thing changed. That's dope. To like test them with. I don't know if you guys saw that. Roll it back if you didn't. Positive for cocaine and, and meth. So, that's pretty cool. Alright guys, let's go ahead and check. I guess that officer just wanted to let us know, hey, <laughs> why else did he beep? I don't know. Positive for cocaine and meth. And let's see what um, other drugs she has. So, uh, it's a white powder. So, let's see if, she, if it's cocaine. Um, okay, negative. And we're just gonna go down the line um, I don't know if you guys like when I do this stuff but comment down below if you like it or not or okay so it's positive for meth yeah comment down below if you guys like when I check out the drugs and stuff like that um, just so I can gauge what you guys like on these highway patrol episodes and we are going to check her vehicle and see what's in there as well all right so she has a knife, a revolver, a pistol, and some alcohol. So we didn't check her for any, uh, if she was under the influence of alcohol. Let's go ahead and do that um, as well. So, oh shoot, I didn't even mean to run into her like that. All right, so let's have a breathalyzer test done on her as well. And um, yeah, we'll just, we'll just go from there and write her charges up. So no, not drinking, just the um, just the drugs. So and the expired license, which is how this whole thing started. So let's go ahead and put our charges in, guys. So creating an arrest report for, or 
you know what no because she had the baggies on her so we are gonna book her if she didn't have the baggies i'd be more inclined to give her a ticket but because she had the baggies and because she um she had guns too did she have a let's see um let me see I wanna okay she had guns yeah and she doesn't have a gun permit so yeah she's getting arrested we're not playing with her today <laughs> that's just gonna be uh that's just gonna be it so why am I on citations oh gosh <laughs> give me a moment guys what am I doing I should not be on citations here there we go I was like, something's not looking right. Whatever. DUI under the influence, yes. And um, narcotics wasn't found on her. It was just found. Um, narcotics wasn't found in the vehicle. It was found on her. And she did have an open container of alcohol, I think. Was it open? I don't know. So we'll leave that alone. And um, firearms, illegal possession of firearms, yes. And also, um, let's see she had oh gosh <laughs> she had possession of meth on her and it was in baggies so we're gonna say intent to distribute um for can we say that for the amount that she had that's what i'm gonna say um and then let's see what can we give her something for the fact that she was driving with an expired license so traffic no documentations right guys so, um, driving with license suspended, license revoked, mm, those aren't any, we can say without license, because technically she doesn't have one. Yeah, I think that might be good. So we got her on DUI, having the methamphetamine, and also um, not driving with a license, and the guns so oh my goodness submit charges i was about to erase all that work i just did <laughs> okay guys so i'm gonna call another um unit to come and get her and then she'll be all set um dispatch can i get a unit to my location please for transport assistance required in harmony all right guys so i'm not even gonna check the guns because she doesn't have a um license for or they're not registered she doesn't what am i trying to say you guys know what i'm trying to say she shouldn't be having guns so it's illegal <laughs> and the uh, transport unit is here to come get her i am going to call a tow truck for her vehicle and uh -oh. also thank that of off other officer for coming out so he can go and let's Piece get a tow truck for her uh for her car Flatbed. Assistance required in uh, Harmony. Alright guys, and for the most part, I think any time um, they're like in baggies or whatever, it's thought of as distribution. But if not, and I'm wrong, you guys let me know in the comments down below. Of course, in a nice way. Um, so, yeah. And we are all set with that. And let's go ahead and clear traffic. All right, before these people start to get angry because we already know how they do. I'm gonna, look at this, you see? I'm gonna drive a little bit further, guys, and see if we get any speeders. If not, I'm gonna go ahead and tell dispatch that we are um, available for calls. So, which I think might be um, the option today. Just because um, it's pretty, it's pretty early. There's not a lot of people out right now but who knows people just might be afraid because they see me driving but yeah so and where are we guys yeah so you never know let's uh yeah matter of fact let's go ahead and let dispatch know that we are available for calls 10 4 okay so i really hope that you guys are enjoying this episode so far if you are give it a thumbs up and if you are not subscribed to my channel yet go ahead and do that right now and also smash that like button and leave a comment down below and guys if you don't know like anything to comment or what to comment like i'm perfectly fine with leaving like um 
the controller emojis like you can do that you know like that's cool too like I appreciate that I know what you're trying to say um with like I don't know yeah so that's fine oh my goodness like sir how long did you want to take that right turn ridiculous all right so we're gonna keep going pretty chill highway patrol unit today got some drugs and guns off of the road so citizens report a civilian in need of assistance on route 60 all right so we have a police impersonator i'm gonna put some lights on uh dispatch oh they said respond code three yo i am late <laughs> I am late. Okay, guys, we got a uh, police impersonator. Don't know what that's about, but let's get there. So, code three, and I don't have my sirens on. Oh, my goodness. What is up with me today, guys? What is up? All right, they're over here. What are they doing all the way over here? All right. Dispatch, show me. Um, I'm, hmm. Can I do this by myself? Or maybe, I don't know, let's see. Let's see what's going on. Dispatch, we have a visual. One, item 12, 10 four, copy that. All right, so I'm on scene. This is the, oh, this is a caller? Okay, let's go ahead and uh, talk to them since we're on scene. All right, hey, how's it going? Oh, officer, I'm glad to see you. The guy drove up behind me, started flashing his high beams. He put, then he put his hand out the window, showing me a badge. He pulled over, got out, started yelling at me, told me he was a cop, then got out of the car. He was, he said he was an illegal alien. I was an illegal alien and I was under arrest. I was born in this country. I'm an American citizen. I told him to F off. He pulled out a gun. So I hit the gas and got the F out of there. But yeah, about this car, <laughs> this is so funny. About this car, it was definitely a police car, um, but it sure as hell, did he say it wasn't? But it was dressed up to look like one. Um, it's a model that you guys drive, I think. It was a chocolate brown colored stainer. The first three digits of the license plate is 07X. Give this man a medal. Okay, because he gave the most information ever. Alright, sir, thank you for all the information. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Alright, so, um, let's see. Where do we go, guys, to find this person? Where do we go? Where do we go? Is it on the map? Can I see it on the map? Okay, because I'm like, dispatch, help a girl out. <laughs> Like, it's ghetto of you not to show me where, the, where it is. Last reported, heading southbound on Mount Vinewood Drive. Okay, so obviously they're driving pretty fast. So is this my code 3? Yeah. Alright guys, so I'm going to try to get there as uh, quick as possible. Um, and see what's going on. Because we need to get this person. We cannot be having uh, impersonators and stuff like that. So it's actually like where I came from, no? Like, get out of the way. Suspect black scene. Teddy oh my gosh. On, uh, Are they going, Mount like, Vinewood super Drive. fast? I feel like I'm not going to catch up to them, guys. I don't know. What do you guys think? I might need some help, too. Like, what? Maybe if we just keep driving straight, we'll find the person? So, yeah. So, there's the yellow circle up ahead on the map, guys. Move out of the way. Uh -huh. Come on now. Okay. Target last reported. Heading eastbound on. All right. So Galileo I see the uh, red dots. Yo, this little swervy swervy stuff. Um, I'm not really with this. Okay, guys. Here we go. I'm jumping and stuff. Oh, this is this is wild. All right. Here we. Ooh, that was close. I'm gonna put my sirens on. All right, here we are. Let's see if we could, uh... Target spotted, oh. heading eastbound okay. on, uh... All right, dispatch, thank Galilea you. Road. Yo, why are they flying like this? This is the unfair advantage. This is kind of unfair. <laughs> why are they 
they flying? Are they over here? Guys. Where are they? Am I missing them? Suspect spotted. Hey, oh, he's bound oh, on guys. Uh, Galileo Road. All right, you know what? We're gonna turn that off and then pull him over. Wait till he uh, drives up and then pull him over. Dispatch, suspect located. Moving to engage. One, Adam, 12. Roger. Okay. Um, let's stop him. How are you even... Why did anybody even believe that this was a police officer? Like, what? He's not even in a proper car. But, okay. Alright, guys. So, uh, we have this situation on our hands. Dispatch, can you uh, send me some backup, please? Assistance required in Grande Sonora Desert. Alright, guys. We are also going to um, stop it around here because I don't know what can happen. Or at least slow it down. Yeah, I don't know what can happen, so let's just cross our T's and dot our I's. And, um, yeah, let's see what's going on. <laughs> All right, she says she's taking the backup position. Let me go ahead and step out my vehicle. I'm going to grab a taser just in case of anything because the guy said that he pulled out a gun. All right, yeah, look at him wearing a vest and stuff. All right, sir, um... You know what? I'm just gonna ask him to get out of the car. Get out of the vehicle. Get out. Please, get out of the vehicle. Get out, because I don't need him to try anything. Get down on the ground. Down on the ground. And he has a pistol. So, yeah. We were not gonna try anything, guys. Like, we're not. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright. Okay. So, we got him in custody. Damn. And uh, let's go ahead and grab him. Attention all units. We are code four. No further units required. Alright guys, we're going to move him to the side right here and let him go. And uh, do you have anything on you that's going to prick me, stab me, poke me, or cause me any harm today? Let's see what you got guys. I see that pistol right there. What the freak? Okay. It said to press control Y. Let's see what that does. That does nothing. Or maybe I did it too late, but let's just pretend I took that pistol off of him. Or let's let my... Mm, can we? If we check him again, will it come off? I don't know. Um, if not... <laughs> okay, so just alcohol. If not, we'll just go ahead and say that. We got it from him. And uh, I'm going to check his vehicle as well. Oh, you know why? It said press control Y, but um, the call already ended, so... Let's uh, go ahead and check his vehicle, see what he has in here. Um, okay. Mm, nothing too much that I'm interested in. Let's go ahead and, uh, and talk to him. So, And also get a pet check. So, bud, what do you think you're doing? What the freak do you think you're doing? Need some fresh air. That's not what I'm talking about why are you stopping people and you're not actual police like you're not batman and you're not superman like you're not you're not any type of hero what are you doing so let's in, let's try some investigation questions um so what exactly are you doing in this area i live with my parents over on rockford drive interesting hmm have you ever been in trouble with the law uh before Okay, he says, yes. Do you have any outstanding warrants? Um, he says, I really hope I don't. Let's get a pet check on this guy and see what's up with him. Like, the nerve. The nerve of this guy. All right, so no active warrants. So we are going to charge him with falsely impersonating a police officer and having a um, an illegal gun, guys. Like, what the heck? what a day <laughs> make sure you guys um you know smash that like button for me and tell me what you guys liked about this episode okay so yeah he doesn't have a gun permit dui um yeah all right let's just let's just tag him guys um what would that be under i don't even know violent crimes firearm 
Um, he was brandishing to that guy because he said he pointed his gun at him. Um, and so I'm going to say that. Can we say that? That's what we're going to say. Um, and then also, what else? I don't even know where that other charge would be. Um, illegal possession of firearm. And um, yeah, where would that be of impersonation? That's interesting. I don't know where I would find that. Few inches later. Okay, guys. So after like five minutes, I found it. It's impersonating a law officer, which is in public offenses. So I definitely had to search for that. And um, yeah, that's what his charges are gonna be. And let's go ahead and call another unit for him and uh, get him. Just get him out of my face. <laughs> Seriously. Assistance required in Grande and Sonora Desert. Alright, the nerve of this guy. Okay, guys, let's go ahead and call a tow service for this vehicle. Assistance required in Grande and then we can also let our other officer go. Thanks, girl, for coming out. I'll keep watch. Alright, he, he messed up. He messed up. So, um, yeah, guys, we're definitely going to see, right? We're definitely going to see um, how much time he's going to get for um, impersonating an officer. So, we're going to get back down um, to, there's so much noise happening right now. But we're going to get back down to a area and, uh, yeah, just figure everything out. So, and he's got the nerves to have, like, a security thing on. Oh, my gosh. We have a suspect on the run on um, Route 68. All right, guys, so we have a uh, speeder down the other way. Oh, they're coming towards us, actually. Oh, he's wildin'. Okay, excuse me, sir. Like, you just saw that. Come on now. Um, let's go ahead and get a local air unit on him so that we can keep track. Helicopter. All right, guys, come on, move out of the way. Lago Zancudo. So I guess people called in because they saw this vehicle speeding in and out of traffic like he's been doing. Let's go ahead and get some units to uh, back me up as well. So, <laughs> it's a nice car though, I give him that. Alright, he's definitely a, uh, a swerver, guys. Like, you see me behind you, sir. Come on now. Alright, he doesn't look like he's wanting to stop or to give up or anything like that so we might have to oh what was that i guess he's trying to make us crack oh my gosh of course of course <laughs> the freak. i need to okay you guys you guys take primary no problem no problem look at my freaking car <laughs> oh my goodness that's the thing with calling backup you never know when they're gonna freaking like smash you and if you guys don't know that was your cue to smash that like button all right I'm done playing with this guy let's get a spec ship support are you serious what the freak guys okay I'm gonna try to go in front of him maybe that will coerce him to make that turn oh, no. all right pit unsuccessful all right let's see what else uh maybe you know what let's try it again Come on, guys. Please don't put it anywhere. Done. Oh. He's headed back the other way. He's headed back the other way. Oh, my gosh. Both of those did not work. All right. I'm going to try to catch up to him and then request a pit. That was unsuccessful. All right. I'm staying on him. I'm staying on him. Let's see. Alright, that one was good, guys. Oh, no! Oh, my goodness. I thought that one was good. Alright, let's see if I can try again. Ooh. This dude is giving me a run for my money right now. Can we get a roadblock support? Can we get something? Some help. Bruh. <laughs> no, he's not. And you guys are not even helping me. Okay, guys, I don't know what else I can try to do. 
Like, we need to, he is not giving up. All right, we got, nope. What the heck? This is insane. This is so insane right now. Okay, we're gonna stay on him though. <laughs> Smash that like button if you guys are liking this. I'm gonna try to pin him right here. No, 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 no. Dang. Let's see how long it's gonna take me to stop this guy. I haven't done a chase in like, oh shoot. What feels like forever. So let's see if we can actually stop him. But he is, all right, I'm gonna go in front of the spike ship. Required. Target vehicle Please might help me out. Six, six, Frank, Alright, there we go. There we freaking go. Oh my gosh. Get your... What the freak? Get your ass out. Now he's on foot. <laughs> what a chase. Alright. I knew he was gonna bail too. Sir, I'm gonna need you to get down on the ground. Like, right, come on, I'm done running after you now. All right, let's get his hands up. Oh my goodness. All right, get down, get down. Like, what the freak? All right, dispatch, we have got the suspect in custody. Whoa. Man. All right, let's grab him and take him back down over there, guys. <laughs> oh my goodness. You know, I'm pretty fine with him being uh, right here. We'll actually let those other officers go. Oh my goodness, guys, thanks for coming out. Thank you for coming out. So we're gonna see what he has in this vehicle, why he was just so adamant to keep running. Let's let him go. All right, guys, is this my vehicle? Okay, no, I guess it's theirs. So I'm actually gonna move out of the way so that we don't, um, like, obstruct traffic or anything. And yeah, so that was my car that was uh, making all that noise. And we are going to stop the traffic, actually. And, oh no, did that stop everybody? Yeah. Oh well, they'll be fine. <laughs> let's uh check what he had in this vehicle right here guys like what the freak okay several flares and cigarettes all right so first he was beating and then he decided to run from us let's go ahead do you have anything on you that's gonna prick me stab me poke me or cause me any harm today now let's go ahead and pat him down and see what's going on like buddy Okay, so he has a gun with a scratched serial number and stolen bank cards. Dispatch, can I get a pet check on this guy? What is going on here? Okay, so license valid, no active warrants. Buddy, what are you doing? <laughs> That's my favorite question. He says he has a right to be quiet, which he does. So let's see if he could tell us anything about those guns okay can you tell me who the weapon belongs to martin phillips okay interesting um let's see what else we can ask him um hmm nope nothing else in that list i want to on that list i want to ask him but um let's see if he's on drugs or something i don't know um have you been drinking today never Okay, um, have you, <laughs> what the heck is wrong with this guy? So, I don't know. I do not know, guys. Let's do a breathalyzer test, um, just to check. Well, actually, no, I'm not getting any, uh, reports from that on him. Just the guns, and I didn't find any paraphernalia on him or in the vehicle, so we might be good with that. I'm going to actually call some backup to my location. Assistance needed in Grande Sonora Desert. And uh, see what's going on. Let me pat him down one more time. Copy that, dispatch. Animals on the loose. All right. Yeah. So, no, um, no, like, 
what am I trying to say? No drugs or anything like that. So we're gonna actually check the guns and see if they're uh, see if they're stolen or whatnot. Oh, it's scratched. So yeah, that's not a good sign at all. And I think I'm going to get a tow truck for this vehicle right here. I've never even seen this vehicle before, like ever. Um, but yeah, let's just go ahead and get a tow truck for it. There we go. And uh, we're gonna put his charges in. So maybe that's why he was running because he had uh, he had those guns in there. So and he knows that he's not supposed to have that. So guys. <laughs> Uh, the tow truck just spawned right there. Um, okay, so creating the arrest report for running from the police and also for um, having, oh, they're in the way, <laughs> uh, legal possession of firearm and serial number tampered with. And um, also moving violations, attempting to flee elude police and also reckless endangerment and um, hit and run because yeah like that was crazy so i think we're all good with that guys submit his charges and uh we're gonna go ahead and let some other officers come and take him dispatch can i get a uh, unit to my location please for transport assistance required and, and you know what we're gonna clear traffic guys so that people can move out of the way and do what they need to do all right thanks chris for coming out oh my gosh <laughs> Everything is just spawning right here. Okay, guys. So, today's episode was, like, pretty interesting. Pretty interesting. Make sure you guys smash that like button on this episode. Because I don't even know what to say about this today. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Let's get back in my vehicle. Let's, um... Yeah, let's fix it because it's damaged. Oh, is this not my car? Guys, why did she get in the vehicle with me? Okay, I'm not sure why. I'm not sure why this chick just got in the vehicle with me, guys. Um, <laughs> but yeah. All right, I'm gonna pull down what am I trying to say? I'm gonna go over here and uh, just take a, oh, oh, okay. All right, here we go. <laughs> Today was so interesting, guys. Let me pull up the computer and see what we have today. So um, here we go. So we got Regina Carter um, for the methamphetamines and the intent to distribute and driving without a license, a suspended license. Um, she got one year in prison and find um and find a couple you know a couple dollars and uh her license was actually suspended so that's not too bad well i mean prison is not anything good but i mean 10 years compared to one year i don't know <laughs> okay so um this guy who was pretending to be a police officer he brandished a firearm to the guy and then he impersonated a police officer and illegal possession of firearm. He was sent to prison for eight uh, months. What? Eight took months? Over mailbox. Okay, that's what he got, guys. And then this guy who was um, speeding, I didn't even, I didn't even hit him with the speeding. I just hit him with the fact that he had firearms and reckless endangerment and attempting to flee. So he got nine years in prison. And, uh, yo, these outcomes is like, what? <laughs> but anyway, that's their charges. Um, comment down below what was your favorite part of this episode today. And also let me know, um, yeah, just what you liked. And also do not forget to share this episode, like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And uh, yeah, if you guys don't know what to say, just leave a comment of a controller. And uh, yeah, definitely let me know that you guys watched this episode today. So um, that's all for today, guys. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. My name is Diamond, and I will catch you guys next time. Peace.